and Baylor four and four in their program matchups. This one decides a Final Four appearance. Please enjoy the game. Ryan Rucco, Rebecca Lobo, Holly Rowe on the call. All right, Maria, well, thank you very much, and it does not get better than this. UConn and Baylor, a trip to the Final Four is on the line. Two legendary coaches about to go at it. Kim Mulkey, the three-time national champion, and Gino Oriema and his record 11 national titles. Taking a look at our tournament bracket, the Elite Eight, it's all set. Two teams will punch their tickets to the Final Four. Tonight, UConn and Baylor with first crack at it. As we Richards defending Paige Beckers. She is long and tall and could give some problems to the freshman. The reigning Defensive Player of the Year, a finalist for it this season as well. Beckers had a look, didn't take it. Now will and hit. Paige Becker's difficult shot. out and push in transition, and they've got a forward who can do what Smith just did, get the board and handle herself. Edwards comes up with a steal. Becker's lines it up and knocks it down. Timeout, Baylor. Great defensive team, but so is Connecticut. Aaliyah Edwards, the freshman with the steal, feeds the other freshman, Paige Becker's. Three, they're feeling it right now in San Antonio. It's had it a really long time, and I think a big part of that great block is the freshmen who have brought the energy to this team. And I think there's a lot of coaches listening said, yeah, I could have a good time with Paige Becker and Aaliyah Edwards. <laughs> Becker's back door lays it in. Nice delivery from Nelson Adota. Kristen Williams with seven points now in the first after 27 in the Sweet 16. Smith unable to hit. Becker secures it. Everything you hope for oh, so this far? Is <laughs> tremendous. Becker's the pull up is good. The freshman Becker's with nine. Bonnie's in. No. Nelson Adota more good D on the interior. Becker's beautifully flung ahead. Beckers thought about it. Beckers, the pull up. Oh, yeah. UConn, since Aaliyah Edwards went out of the game with the two fouls, and Aubrey Griffin. Urson waits. Rejected by Griffin. Kim Mulkey thought Griffin caught Urson on the wrist. Beckers splitting the D. Couldn't finish, but is fouled. Well, he, you know, he was kind of hard on her after their game against Iowa. Second time these teams have ever met in the NCAA tournament. They met in the semifinals back in 2010. A UConn win as Beckers slips inside for two. 15. Paige Beckers can find a little bit of daylight. She can get through it. And here, slices through two defenders. No help side there. We saw her dad in the stands watching here in San Antonio. Westbrook, back door, Beckers got hit, and Paige Beckers is going to shoot two. Free throw on the first attempt from Paige. She hits the second. Going to let it be very physical. Three-point Baylor lead. Egbo has it knocked away. Beckers trying to flag it down. Look out from behind. She gets crushed. And Paige Beckers, freshman who broke so many records for games, the first 123 games of her career. She's had at least 20 in each of the last three entering tonight. Becker's nice cut to free herself for two. It's a 20-point evening for the Schwinn. Sarah Andrews in for and has her pass stolen. Becker's a three. You bet! how the last set ended though for Connecticut with an on-ball screen for Paige Beckers. Beckers the leaner rolls in! 25 for Beckers!
There's a reason Paige Beckers is a favorite for National Player of the Year. She can get to the spot she wants to get to. She can get her shot off against... That, that had last hit Williams and not her. Here's Beckers, another three. You bet! Paige Beckers is feeling it! A 17-0 UConn run. Bickle into the game for Baylor. Harrington, and that's going to be another charge. Ten seconds to go. The freshman Andrews with 13 seconds left. Harrington wants it on the block. Eight seconds left. Back to Carrington. Six seconds left. Carrington on the drive. Carrington forces it up. No! Rebound, UConn! And with four tenths of a second left. Brought in just for this. Bickle. Down the floor. Caught by Beckers. And the streak lives. A 13th straight trip to the final four for the UConn Huskies. They outlast Baylor. 69 16. I am not going to let the game come to me when it's time to go to a Final Four. I'm going to go out and take it. A huge part of their big run in the second half to put them in this position as they go to there. And Paige is with Holly Rowe. Paige Beckers, there's less than a second left on the clock. How were you able to get the most defensive stop and interception of your career? Well, Holly, I want to tell a story. So today we are getting back from testing, and I started singing Never Say Never, which I haven't sang in years. And uh, Jaden Smith's part was they're bigger than us, they're stronger than us. And I said that, and I sang, and then as soon as I walk into testing, I see on the TV Jaden Smith and Karate Kid, and that's, it's God. I mean, I asked him to give us strength for this game, and I just wanted to share that story because we played with God's strength today. You never say never. There was a moment in this game, Dee Dee Richards, who had been hounding you on defense, gets injured. Where did you take that moment and run with it? Yeah, I mean, it was, it's awful to see somebody get injured, but I knew how well she was defending me and how well she's been defending people um, uh, across her whole career. So I just try to stay aggressive and stay with the strong mentality. Coach, how did you think Gina Oriema did as a coach here in this big moment today? That's the guy. I mean, he, he makes all the big calls. He, he's been doing this for 36 years, so I would expect nothing less. What does it mean to you to be in the Final Four as a freshman? Speechless. Um, it's so crazy. I dream of moments like this. Um, and I'm just so thankful for my team and my coaching staff, the confidence that they have in me, the trust that they have in me. Uh, I just love them so much, and I'm so proud of our team. Never say never. Thank you, Paige. Thank you, Holly. Coach Oriema, this yeah. was tight. This was hectic. How did your...